Hi, it's Julie Meller, Easy Swing and Golf Coach. Firstly, before I start this video, I've got an apology to make to you. Uh, I think the last two or three videos that I've put out there, I don't think the sound quality was very good. Uh, we were on a, a coaches conference weekend and we were in the moment and we were just chatting away about golf and I wanted to capture it and share it with, uh, with my subscribers. And uh, so my sincere apologies if you couldn't hear the videos very well. Uh, and I'd also like to say a big thank you to the new subscribers to my channel. For some reason over the last w uh, month or so it's gone up by over a thousand and I'm not quite sure what's happening but I'd just like to say a big thank you and welcome to everybody. Today's video is about overcoming a bad shot. Who's played with that golfer or are you that golfer who reacts badly to a bad shot? Miss hit one bang the club into the ground, bang your club into the bag, walk off in a huff, swearing and uh, generally not very happy. Uh, not always the easiest person to play with by the way. Um, this video is about how we manage that uh, and whether it's helpful or not reacting in a bad way. The Easy Swing coaches uh, have a saying and it's called it's a nice day. And this is really about self-management and I know this is a video and it's not real life and we're not in the heat of battle but I think you'll get the message once you've finished watching it. So it's called It's a Nice Day. We're out playing golf, we're not in the office, there's a lot worse places to be in the world. It's a nice day, you're probably with your friends. It's a nice day. We get to play a shot. I've just topped that one straight into the pond. How would most golfers react to that one? Um, probably tense, frustration. And what will frustration lead to? In my world, it, it leads to an awful lot of, of, of tension in the body. Tight grips, short muscles. This then massively affects rhythm and affects your mood almost. Um, don't overreact to a bad shot. Sometimes we just miss it one. Your swing hasn't fallen apart. Sometimes we just miss it a bad shot. So this is how we deal with it. So I fit one into the into the pond. I've not reacted in any way, shape or form. I've just missed it a shot. I then get an opportunity to have another go. That one's far better. It's a nice day. Frustration leads to tension. Tension leads to inefficient muscles. That massively affects your rhythm and is going to um, it's going to probably destroy your round of golf. We call it catastrophizing. Sometimes we hit a bad shot. It's not the end of the world. But what I would like to do before I end this video, and you can hear the mower now in the background that's just decided to kick up. I just want to share with you. Um, the best example I've ever seen of self-management. So I think it was about a year ago, I'm playing with a four handicapper. We're on the 17th tee and he's four under par gross. Fabulous round of golf, hardly misstruck a ball all day. And he's on the tee and he's not missed it a drive. I think he's hit the middle of the fairway on every, on every hole. And he's hit it I don't even think it got to the end of the tee. He turned round, he got, looked at his drive and he went, um, oh, that's interesting. And he put it in his bag. I think he got a full rescue out and knocked that down the fairway. Next shot went onto the green, he's hold his putt for par and he went on to birdie the last. How do you think most people react in that situation? So having the, a really fabulous round of golf They've missed it a shot, then they're in the rough, they're trying to recover from the rough, they might take four or five shots to get it on the green, two or three put, triple, quadruple bogey, bogey the last and they finish, finish over par. Self-management is critical and it's a skill. Um, don't overreact if you miss it a shot, it's not the end of the world. Self-control, 
that's going to keep you calm, it's going to keep your muscles more relaxed, you'll swing more efficiently and you're probably going to have a nice game of golf. Um, don't be that angry golfer, it's, it's useless, it's not helping one, one little bit and it's generally off-putting for your playing partners, so give them a little bit of consideration too. I hope you find this video helpful. Uh, if you like the videos, please subscribe to my channel, give us a thumbs up and share with your friends. Thanks for watching. Bye.